Adria is well known for manufacturing everything from panel van conversions up to mighty A-classes, but this time around it's turned its attentions to the camper van and has come up with a cracking new idea in the twin 500S. Now what's so good about this is that it's on a 5 metre long wheelbase, so it has to have some fairly clever design ideas to actually work. One of which, the best thing, is that it has a sliding door on both sides of the vehicle. Continental manufacturers bringing vans into the UK generally don't rehand them, so the sliding door or the habitation door will not be on the UK near side. This means you have to disgorge your passengers into traffic if driving in the UK. I don't think this is the reason why on this van there are twin sliding doors. It's more to do with the fact that it's only five meters long. So having this kind of open access is extremely valuable. So you can see that having these double sliding doors means that you can have the seating group around the table in the middle of the van. Spin the front seats round to face the passengers at the back and suddenly you have an extremely sociable area. A fantastic design solution and one that will be very popular, I'm sure. Now you're not really going to be cooking a Sunday roast in one of these vans, but the cooking facilities are nonetheless very good. You get three gas burners, a circular sink and a compressor fridge, plus storage solutions above and below. And the wide open aspect at the rear of the vehicle means you can impress the outside world with your culinary skills. You won't find a washroom in all five metre long camper vans, but Adria's solution is very clever. You push back on this little partition here to reveal a washroom. You have your swivel loo and the cassette underneath, of course, and there's also a shower. Where is that, you may be asking. I found it, it's in the floor. Very clever thinking indeed. And there is your shower tray with a curtain up above to partition you off from the rest of the vehicle. The Adria Twin 500S has a starting price of just under 39,000 pounds. Put a few nice desirable extras on it and the price will increase to 43,000, but that still seems good value for something as clever as this. Dealers I've spoken to at the show say that they've got lots of orders in and there's been a massive interest from the public. So watch this space. This one could literally fly off the forecourts.